HIPV lures are made using either 1.5 mil, 2 mil, or 6 mil density tubing paired with 1.5 inch pieces of dental wick in either large, medium, or small thickness. The combination of tubing density and wick size affect the lure's release rate. Cut a 2 inch long segment of your chosen tubing. Since both ends are open, you will need to close one end. Do this using a heat sealer. Once sealed, insert the desired size of dental wick. And now you are ready to add your chemical. To begin making the lures, we use a micropipette with a 5 mil tip. We'll then select our chemical, and each chemical has a different amount that we use, which is associated with the release rate of the lure that we want. So for this particular one, we'll be using 3.5 mils, which will then be placed on, directly onto the dental wick. From there, we'll use a heat sealer to seal the open end of the bag using the same sealer. And then that is your lure. Each lure only has one individual chemical on it. So in order to combine chemicals, we'll take individual lures and staple them together. Once all the lures are made, we store them in the freezer inside resealable foil bags. This helps to keep the chemical from releasing from the lure. In order to hang your lure and trap to monitor your natural enemies, uh, we're going to start show, uh, with showing you how to use the orange delta trap. And for this one, we have our lure. And inside the delta trap on the wire, we have a key ring and a binder clip. And we're just going to reach in and open the binder clip and attach the lure. So we have it hanging uh, just like that. And then we take our sticky card that fits inside the trap place it in there and close up the side. And then we hang these traps in the upper third canopy of the tree. Just like that. So another style of trap that we used in some of our research and testing these lures um, was a uh, something we modified with a hanger so that we could hang the sticky the sticky traps like panels. And this is just a um, bent hanger with two binder clips attached into the neck right here. And the binder clips, we have one facing down and the other one facing up, and they're clipped together. So for this, we take our lure and we clip it to the binder clip facing upwards and then we take our sticky card and it's bent at a slight angle uh, and then we take the card and we attach it to the binder clip that's facing down. You can also use different color traps such as this yellow sticky card here and then Peel off the protective cover and you have the yellow sticky panel that's ready to hang. And with the hook of the hanger here, we just pick a branch about in the upper third of the canopy of the tree and hang our trap. Just like that.